how lost in the Matrix are you kids at this point? Thanos in the movie, the Marvel's movie, he's based on a real uh, god called Thanatos. But Thanatos is the god of a painless death. He's related to Hypnos, the god of sleep. He won't torture you and kill you. He painlessly kills. And I think that there's a lot of like numbing that's going on in preparation for a sort of a metaphorical soft spiritual kill and that's yeah. a lot of the what we're consuming it numbs it injects yeah. you with a numbing agent and you're just like oh it's okay you're actually about to be euthanized you won't suffer you won't scream and be terrified you'll quietly slip away into, yes. the, and, into the space and oh that's a great example that's exactly the type of delirium that tranquilizer that shot me this last two months it wasn't like I got fucking hit in the head. It was like a oh, someone just threw the ketamine in the water. Oh, and then just started just I just fucking disintegrated and yeah. and like really felt like a floating nothingness. The content, the the culture, the propaganda, the everything, the ide the ideology. It's making me sick. I'm I'm really worried that the the response to that was universally so positive. Like people really loved that. And I'm like, it's not real. He's not in the room with you. He's not even talking to you. He's talking to the girl with blue hair. But like, how lost in the matrix are you, kids? At this point, it's it's all about emotional satiation in through a consumerist approach. He won't torture you and kill you. He painlessly kills painlessly kills painlessly kills